Hi, this is Miss Sass. Um, this is just a little bit about you. One at Art John Keats. We have three classes, Donaldson class, Seuss class, and Albert class. In Albert class, Miss James is the class teacher. She is in on Monday to Thursday. And Miss Joseph is the class teacher on Friday. <laughs> it is really, really important that you label everything, please. It makes it really hard um, to match um, items to children if they're not named. Um, so if you could please make sure everything is labelled. Um, from PE kits, water bottles, lunch bags, book bags, everything. <laughs> um, uniform is a normal school uniform, Tuesday to Friday. On Monday, year one have PE. So please make sure that your child comes to school in their PE kit. And it's really important that the shoes are Velcro shoes, please, so that the children can be independent and do their shoes themselves. If they can already tie shoelaces, then they are welcome to wear laced shoes to school. Here is a list of the uniform expectations for year one and the PE uniform expectations. We have certain values at Art John Keats that we consistently talk about with the children. Um, they are reflected in our day-to-day -day running of the school and also in our team's virtual assemblies that we have at school. This is a brief overview of the Year 1 curriculum and the Year 1 day-to-day -day timetable. Because of lockdown, Year 1 now have afternoon exploration where the children learn through play. This will continue until Christmas um, where the teachers are constantly observing and assessing the children while they are learning through play so that we can ensure that they meet their early learning goals. Lunch is available. Um, currently, we have a choice of sandwiches, tuna, cheese, egg or chicken, which the children get to choose daily. Um, you are also very welcome to bring a pat lunch. If you do bring a pat lunch, please ensure that the pat lunch is healthy. No sweets or fizzy drinks. Um, no nuts at all, please. Um, and um, if you have any questions, please contact your class teacher. For phonics, we have an hour's phonics lesson every day. The children are put into phonics groups to match their learning. Um, and they have phonics every day for one hour. Every Friday, phonics homework will be sent home. Um, this will normally be a book or a reading activity. It's really important that the children read this every day, um, following the words with their finger or with uh, a pencil or a stick. Um, from Autumn 2, the children will also have a weekend diary, just like they had in reception. This will be sent home on a Friday and returned on a Monday. We will use it in our Monday's literacy lesson, which is always a recount, writing about our weekend. Homework for reading will be the phonics reading, and the children will also get to choose a reading for pleasure book. On a Friday, this will be taken from the class library. It is by no means an expectation that the children will read this independently. It is a book that they have chosen just for fun. Therefore, they can either read the book using the pictures, they can create their own story with it, or you can read it to them before they go to bed. And this will be changed every Friday if the book is returned. So as well as reading, in year one we also have spellings. Five spellings will be sent home every week. These are the reception high frequency words. Um, and it's really important that your child practices these just for a few minutes every day. The best way to do this is to use the strategy of look at it, say it, cover it, write it, and then check it. We are very fortunate to have some traction men to take home, just like you had in reception with Oscar the Owl. Um, in year one, we have traction men. 
And this is a story that we've been reading this term. I'm sure your child will be, be able to tell you about many of the adventures Traction Man has been up to so far. Um, he will go home in a bag with a special Traction Man diary. If you could please complete no more than two pages in the diary. You can add photos, writing or drawings. It's entirely up to you. Um, and then on Monday, if you could please return it so that your child can share what Traction Man has done with them at the weekend. And we can also make sure that it is cleaned, ready to be sent home the following Friday. So just a general summary so far, um, the weekend diary will be sent home on a Friday and return Monday, reading for pleasure books will be sent home Friday and re um, returned Friday, phonics homework is every Friday, this can stay at home, PE kit should be worn to school every Monday and if your child gets to take Traction Man home, um, for one particular week, it will be sent home on a Friday and returned on Monday. There are many different ways that you can communicate with school and that school will communicate with you. We have Class Dojo, um, we have the school website, you can email the school or phone the school. The school will also in provide information via newsletters, text messages, the Twitter page and YouTube page. Um, unfortunately, the assemblies are not currently happening um, as they normally would. They are all virtual just within school, um, but hopefully once life returns back to normal, um, they will be able to resume. Um, the pastoral vision at Arch on Keats is that our school is a safe environment for our children, that we have good communication between home and school, and that we have um, a behaviour policy which is consistently used. This is the behaviour policy that is used in Year 1. In Year 1, the children all start on their planet, and they also all start on the green traffic light. The planet, the Earth, the Moon and the Sun are for um, rewards, so the children's photo will go up, it will never go down. For the traffic light, this is the sanction system, so the children will move to amber if they have a warning, and then red if they have a few minutes for time out. If your child does reach red for any reason, they will be, you will be contacted by the class teacher, either on Class Dojo Unfortunately, um, when it's drop-off time and pick-up time, we're not able to um, have parent conversations um, due to social distancing and due to ensuring that we keep the flow, the line moving as quickly as we possibly can. Um, if you could please be really patient with us while we're learning faces, um, especially when parents are wearing masks. If your child is going home with another adult, um, if you could please phone the office and let them know so they can let the class teacher know in advance. Um, the morning drop off, now the children will just come into the school, into the main entrance and pick up time um, is hasn't changed so pick up time the children if you can please line up in a socially distanced manner wearing a mask um, when it's your turn if you can come to the cone um, and the class teacher will release your child um, please note that we are only sending one child at a time um, if you do need to speak to the class teacher please contact them on class dojo or call the office and they will call you back as soon as they possibly can. Uh, unfortunately due to COVID we currently are not able to offer extracurricular activities um, but hopefully this will resume once life is back to normal. If you do have any questions please feel free to contact your class teacher on Class Dojo or you can call the office and they will get back to you as soon as possible. Have a lovely day. Take care.